way to the meeting house for the first time ever. Uh, a surprise. <laughs> We've heard a lot about it. Uh, apparently there was a family there. They had children. Uh, the daughter, or no, the two sons were born with, completely without skin. Yeah. And then the daughter was born with like a third of her skin missing. And they just, you know, all of them shortly died. Generals area exactly. there. There's people from the Revolutionary War, the Water Battle of Waterloo, yeah. um, slaves. I mean, anybody. And then above it all, there's that picture. Oh yeah, that that critically acclaimed. Yeah, <laughs> the, the one, like, whatever it was. Oh wait, this is it, right? Yeah, I think so. Yeah, she said the gravel. Yeah, she did. Like you said, she did say it was the gravel driveway. So. Right in the middle of the screen, guys. Well, we need to go check that way. Kind of learn about the people that are buried here when it was built. That's where the first house originally stood. The little massive wall right there. So that's cool. Yeah. But and, and I might take a little stone, like a little collection piece home with me. So hey, hey. Uh, but yeah, now we're just gonna go look at the house, and <laughs> you lovely folks get to come with. Blair Witch movie. <laughs> oh Ooh, my! Big walks. Hey there, buddies. Yeah, they have a nest somewhere. Okay, well, hey there. This is a great first start. All these bugs. Hey, <laughs> you're doing great. Oh. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> oh, it's cool in here. Honestly, don't really know what I expected, but no. this wasn't it. <laughs> <laughs> Is there a Bible in there? Maybe, maybe. That's cool. That is cool. Sorry about my phone. Sorry about my phone. Hmm. No? I mean, it's kind of cool in here right now, so I guess. Holy crap, dude. <laughs> Holy guacamole. <laughs> it's 
Pretty out here. Red River Meeting House is the first Presbyterian church built in America in the late 1700s. It was rebuilt a total of four times due to destructive deterioration and mysteriously burning down once. We discovered an image of a tourist that was taken here outside of the church. She had a black upside down cross on her forehead and behind her was a hunched over demon-like creature standing next to the church. And that is the exact same entity that we are calling out tonight with that Bible. There are an estimated 400 bodies buried here and less than 150 tombstones which means there are bodies scattered all throughout the land. But we want to figure out how many bodies are actually buried here. As we're here at the Red River Meeting House, uh, we have cameras set up, we have the equipment out, and we're ready to go. Uh, we're excited about this, and we've been waiting for this for a long time, and uh, yeah, let's go. Let's do it. All right, so something here, that dark entity here, does not like it when you read from the Bible. So... Uh, What I want you to do is I want you to stay up here and read the Bible. I'm going to go in the back. And last time I was here, you were reading the Bible and I was in the back. I got really aggressive for no reason towards you and towards everybody else in the church. Yeah. So I'm going to go back there by myself. It's just me and you. You're going to read the Bible. I'm going to be back there feeling the energy and taking pictures. Three. So far, I haven't felt anything. It's just been kind of dull back here. I've kind of felt a little jittery. That's not it. Just a little jittery. I've, I've, I haven't felt anything negative. Nothing has happened so far, though. No. My mirror hasn't changed. Nothing. Yeah. We'll get it. We'll get it active. Don't worry. Yeah. All right. All right. Lights out. Oh, I didn't know we were recording. Oh, we're just out of sync. It's fine. Now chapter 28 of Jeremiah. And it came to pass the same year, in the beginning of the reign of Zedekiah, king of Judah, in the fourth year and the fifth month, that Hananiah, the son of Ozu, and the prophet, who was of Gideon, spake unto me in the house of the Lord, in the presence of the priests and all the people, saying, Thus speaketh the Lord of hosts, the God of Israel, saying, I have broken the yoke of king of Babylon. For two full years I will bring again into the place of all the vessels of the Lord's house that Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, took away from this place and carried them to Babylon. And I will bring again to this place Jeconah, the son of Jehethun, king of, king of Judah, with all the captives of Judah that went into Babylon, saith the Lord, for I will break the yoke of the king of Babylon. Then the prophet Jeremiah said of the prophet Hanai, the present What? <laughs> these are the words of the uh, Jeremiah the prophet sent from Jerusalem unto the residue of the elders, which were carried away captives, and to the priests, and to the prophets, and to all the people whom Nebuchadnezzar had carried away captives from Jerusalem to Babylon. After that, Jeconiah the king, and the queen, and the Enos, the princess of Judah, and Jerusalem, and the prophets, and the sons, who departed from Jerusalem. By the hand of Elasa, the son of Shaphan, and Gemariah, or Gemariah, sorry, the son of Hilkah, who Zedekiah, king of Judah, sent to Babylon, to Nebuchadnezzar, king of Babylon, saying, Thus saith the Lord of hosts of God of Israel, that all that are carried away in Baptist, whom I have caused to be carried away from Jerusalem, are to Babylon. Build ye houses, dwell in them, and plant gardens, and eat the fruit of them. Take ye wives, and beget sons and daughters, and take wives for your sons, and give your daughters to husbands, that they may bear sons and daughters, that ye may increase there, and not diminish. And seek the peace of the city, whether I have caused you to be carried away captives, and pray unto the Lord for it, for in peace thereof shall ye have peace. For thus saith the Lord of hosts, the God of Israel, let not your prophets and your diviners that be in the midst of you deceive you, neither hearken the dreams of which may ye cause to be dreamed, for they prophesy falsely even to my name. I have not sent them, saith the Lord. For thus saith the Lord, that after seven years accomplished at Babylon, I will visit you and perform my good word towards you, and cause you to return to this place. 
For I know the thoughts that I think towards you, said the Lord, thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you an expected end. And ye then shall ye call upon me, and you shall and pray unto me, and I will hearken unto you. And ye shall seek with me, find me, and ye shall search for me with all your heart. And I will be found with you, saith the Lord, and I will turn away your captivity, and I will gather you from the nations and from all the places what, whither I have driven you, saith the Lord, and I will bring you again to the place whence I caused you to be carefully captive. You ready to stop the recording? Three, two, one. Live review. What was that? Huh? That take that. Remember when I said take a seat? It's at this time that I started feeling anger and aggression. I did not feel good and I did not feel like myself. I felt really weird just then. Are you talking about like when you were looking at me? Mm -hmm. I want to fight you. Mm -hmm. I wanted to fight you. You wanted to what? Fight you. Fight me? Mm -hmm. Why? When you looked at me. Cause like you were looking and you were staring up straight and I was like thinking about it and I was like he doesn't look like happy and then you like cut your eyes at me and just stared at me and I was laughing because I thought you I was like because <laughs> I was shining the light like yeah. I thought that's what you were getting mad about and you looked yeah. at me and then I just felt this like different like pissed off anger coming at me and I was like what, what is this dude's problem? I didn't feel that. Right. I felt weird. Like, that wasn't. Uh, sorry, let's go. Thank mm -hmm. you. 
Is there anybody in here? Can you tell us who you are? Can I speak to the darker entity that's known here? What is that? Did I say Dalton? What was that? What was that? Did I say Dalton? Did I just see you earlier? Step who, to the. Who step, was that I saw? Step to the right a little bit. Yeah. Step to the right. Stay in the. Yeah, right there. Who did I just see earlier? What is that? What is that? What is that? Are you from the Revolutionary War? How many spirits are in here right now? There was a picture taken of a lady, and you were seen in the background that was an upside down going cross on her forehead. Do you know anything about that? Who did that? Was it that darker spirit? I'm see you fat. Huh? I'm gonna see you fat. Maybe I'm gonna wrap with you rather than a little thing. I know last time I was here, I read from the Bible, and somebody didn't like it. So, can you tell me who that was? Or did you not like me? Why is the darker entity here? What is your purpose here? You have no purpose here. This is a church. Uh, we may have purpose, but what is it? What was that? Huh? I don't know what it said. It's like, what's it? If you listen closely, you can hear two knocks before I start walking to the SB11. You'll hear it once while I'm standing still and then again after I start walking. And if it was me, you'd hear it continue after I kept walking towards the SB11.
What? That what? What did she say? I have no idea. It was like it was like it wasn't this language. How many of you are in here? Some of this is dust. Is there anybody in here with me? Who's been affecting me? Why did I look at Ramsey like that? Why did you make me laugh? I don't remember laughing. Can you show yourself to me? Can you appear in front of this camera? Oh! Just caught an orb. Can you appear in front of this camera? Oh! Can you appear in front of this camera? Oh! Show yourself! Okay. What about the people buried over here? I see that you're, uh, where you are buried, your burial sites are, they've been deconstructed per se they've been broken and busted up and it doesn't look like it was by natural causes standing at your front gate can any of you come to the gate and greet me Go to the generals and see if they're there. Okay. So are any of the generals over here? free to use my energy if you need to to use this device but only to use this device currently okay. is there anybody in this cabin with me Tell me your name! What the fuck? Holy shit! You gotta let a brother know! That's right! Are you want to talk to him or something? Because you can't hear me. Oh, yeah, man. You can't hear me. You got that. Tell me that. That was okay. Would you hear the voice? Like, hey, somebody like, hey. Like, outside.
If you look left, you'll see an orb fly into Ramsey's back. If it was dust or a bug, you would see it go into him or behind him and come out the other side in front of him. Okay. Now is there anyone in here? Is that as loud as it goes? Okay. Now. Oh, we just got an orb going inside of you. Again, you see an orb go into and disappear into Ramsey's face. Could they be trying to use the spirit box and communicate with us? Say something. Speak with me. I'm not here to hurt you. I'm here to talk. I know you probably don't talk to a lot of people these days. So come talk with me. Feel free to use my energy to help you speak. Do you like the questions that were being asked earlier? Do they offend you? Do they anger you? Do they anger you? Do they anger you? Is there anything maybe one of the soldiers want to say to their family members that they didn't get to see? Any last words to your loved ones? What about the generals that are buried on this property? Yeah, every time I spoke about them earlier, something would happen. And I don't like the generals, but well, the generals are still here. Waiting to protect their home, waiting for another attack. Do you know you're dead? Oh, that was an orb. That was a legit orb. We leave and never come back. This could be your only chance to say something. Is there anything you have to say? Do you like that we're here? Do you want us to leave? No? So you want us to stay, right? Why? And what if we don't? Is there anything outside? Anything that could harm us? Will you harm us? Is that your intention?
You can take my energy and use it. Did you hear a voice with her? I did. I did. Is it female? Mm -hmm. Is it? Are there any little girls here? Are there any children here? Do you want to play? What about the spirit of the little boy? The one that got rabies, are you here? They changed you up in that barn. Why? Oh, that was one that emitted its own light. Why? Why? Was that you? Can you make a sound for us? Open the door? Don't, don't be intimidated by us. Don't be intimidated by this electronic equipment. I know it's something that you've probably never seen before, but don't be scared of it. It's not going to hurt you. And don't be scared of that dark entity. Ain't nothing I hate to be scared about. Don't let him hold you back or prevent you from coming forth. And you stand your ground and you need to fight against him. Give him no control. Make him powerless. Make him scared of you. What is that? It was like an ore that was just floating like right, like right over there. And it just kind of flooded upwards. This is probably one of the greatest orb manifestations we've ever caught on camera. Staying in frame for a total of 8 seconds, hovering in the middle, and then disappearing in the distance. What is that? Is that the that? What is that? The Red River Meeting House is a place that will affect you during and after the investigation. Getting evidence anywhere from them saying your name. What is that? Did they say Dalton? To spirits following you around, jumping from person to person. Oh, we just got a four. This place would end up affecting me for the next week following the investigation making me super irritated and aggressive at work, with friends, and at home. It would take a while to fully shake off the negative energy from this place.